Hi everybody, it's Get Real in the Kitchen with Deanna Olson and sometimes we think we don't have anything around to make dinner of, but most of the time we have cans of beans in the, in the um, cupboard. So this is a, what turned this, this can of black beans turned into four very large um, bean burgers and veggie bean burgers. So, and so if you're Tex-Mex, uh, restaurant isn't anywhere close by, then go ahead and um, make your own. Um, and these veggie burgers are can be very tricky. But uh, what I did is uh, drain the beans and rinse them, and then I put them in a little food processor, small food processor, one can of beans. And I add, and the recipe's below, and I added cumin, chili, um, some liquid smoke, some salsa, um, and green chilies out of the can. These were things I had, oh, and a, a bunch of really already chopped fine uh, red onions. So these are things you already have around the house, right? And you can mix and match this depending on what you have on hand. <clears throat> and then two, uh, after they came out, so then that, this came out of the food processor looking like this. And uh, I put salt and pepper on them and added about a fourth of a cup of garbanzo uh, flour. And you could add um, some um, oatmeal. You could add some rice if you have some leftover rice. And then this used to be uh, the binder, which was uh, a little one egg that I uh, beat. And this was half of the egg that was left. However, the cat got on the counter and ate the egg. So um, uh, as a result, I don't have an egg to show you in off, so I am in the doghouse. So I just blended those together and formed the patties. And here was trick num big trick number one. I put the formed patties on a sheet pan and put them in the freezer for a good 40 minutes. And uh, you could put those on nonstick foil or something to make them easier to come off. And I flipped them once in, in the middle so they get firm on both sides. Then I just put some oil in the skillet and uh, put the um, burgers in. The last trick, as I'm flipping the burgers, um, that silicone spatula, I sprayed it with a nonstick spray several times to get them to be able to turn. And that's it, there you have it. Please subscribe and I will see you, and this is so live, from Denver, one take. See you next time.